Hey, how you doing? This is Rob, the Kitchen Serini. We're here for another installment of Beer You Can Eat. So what are we eating today? I'm gonna to tell you what we're gonna eat today. We're gonna to eat saffron lager battered shrimp. What was that? What was that noise? Is that you falling on the ground? Cause it sounded so delicious that the wave of deliciousness knocked you down? Yeah, I think it did. And it should have, cause it's good. And it's dead simple to make. All right, let's knock this out. So what do you gotta have? I use jumbo shrimp. They're like little lobsters. They're delicious. Anyway, so what you do is you're gonna deshell them, and you're gonna devein them, and I cut off the stupid tail because they're stupid. Next, what do you need? You need flour. What kind of flour? You need any kind of flour you got. You got your baker flour, you got your pastry flour, you got your coconut flour. Whatever flour you got, you can use that flour. Next, what do you need? You need beer. This can't be beer you can eat without beer. So what kind of beer do you need? Boom, your Hefeweizen. You can't go wrong with a good Hefeweizen. Why? It's a wheat beer. Why? Wheat beers go good with what? With citrus. Who else likes citrus? Shrimp like citrus. Next, you need salt. I don't need to explain salt. Next, you need one egg white. That's it. Yellow is no good for your heart. Throw them out. Next, you need some juice. I told you about the citrus. It's very important. And finally, this, my friends, is saffron. Or saffron, as they say in Spain. What is saffron? I don't know. Do you know? You don't know. That's okay. You're not supposed to know. Why? Because it's a secret. Saffron is the pistol of the flower, the veritable sex organ of these beautiful flowers that sprinkle the countryside in Spain and they're picked by the virgin hands of bosomy women. That's right. They're delicious. And gram for gram, it's more expensive than cocaine, but trust me, it's worth it. Let's get down to it. You take your flour, you put it in a bowl. You take your beer, you put it in a bowl. You take your salt, you put it in a bowl. You take your egg white, you're gonna put it in a bowl. You're gonna mash that up. You're gonna make a good batter with it. Make it look like you're making pancakes, but you're not making pancakes. No, no, you're making batter. That looks good. Next, you're gonna take your citrus juice and you're gonna put it in with your saffron. You're gonna infuse the juice of the citrus with the saffron. Once that's done, boom, in the bowl. You whisk it together. Now, get your oil ready. You're gonna want two inches of oil in a pan. That's four fingers deep. Trust me, you're gonna heat it up to 360 degrees. Now, you might be asking me, Rob, what about dipping sauces? You gotta have me some dipping sauces. May I suggest this to you? It's called stachinase. Sounds nice, no? Bougie even. Let me, let me show you how it's done. It's like, a, it's like a magic trick. First of all, you take a handful of pistachios without the shells. I can't believe I have to tell you that. You can put it in a blender. Done. Then you take some juice. Citrus. It's very important. Put it in there. Nice. Then you take some mayo. Good old helmets. Boom. In there. And then you mix it. Just like that. That's it. Stachinase. And it's delicious. Because you get that mayo, you get that citrus, and you get the pistachio flavor. It's very subtle. And it goes great with the saffron and beer. Anyway. Now, you take your shrimp. You want to dip it in the flour first. You put it in the batter, you get it nice and coated, and then you're gonna wanna put it slowly in the pan. Slowly in the pan, why? You want the batter to start cooking before it hits the bottom of the pan. That way it doesn't stick. What's the matter with you? No one taught you anything? So like that, boom, done. You wanna do this kinda quick, because they're all gonna cook pretty quick, and you don't want them to burn. So you put them in the pan, they're gonna get nice golden brown, and when they do, you're gonna take them out and put them on a plate with a paper towel. Let them sit for about two, three minutes. Then you take them off. You arrange them nice on a plate like this. And in the middle, you put your stachnaise. Uh -huh. And we're done here. I mean, look at that. Look at that. I mean, if this doesn't seal the deal, I mean, I can't eat it for you, too. You know what I mean? That's all we got here, people. You got uh, your saffron lager battered shrimp. It's delicious. I'm Rob with the Kitchen Serini. This has been Beer You Can Eat, and I'm gonna. Bye-bye.